Hello everyone, welcome to my product page. In this video, I'm going to explain the process of the FTK Imager, but before, I'm going to do a quick introduction about it. FTK Imager is one of the Access Data's principal tool and is most well known and well loved in forensic community, just because it does exactly what we ex expect it to do. It creates forensic images, it's reliable, it's robust and it's free. It does a lot of things. It allows us to create forensic images. It allows us to do forensic preview. It allows us to be able to take certain type of images, type of images where we don't take all of the data. We can take different types of images and it has lots of functionality with it. FTK Imager contains four principal panes which we open it up and we can follow these panes as we go along. We have our evidence tree, we have our file list, we have our vivo pane, and then we have our properties pane, which has got a number of features inside it. But one thing it doesn't do is that it doesn't write block. So when we are using FTK Imager, depending on the circumstances that we presented with, we have to be working with our write blocking tools as well. And that's a really important thing to remember. I'm going to present some important videos that will help um, that will help explain from the insta installation process to identifying evidence. Hope you enjoy and learn the process. Thank you.